It's time for the kitchen tip of the day. Now, you're probably realizing that I'm not posting these every day, but when I have one, it's the tip of the day. So today's tip is how to make your own almond butter. So don't buy it, because you don't have to. It's super easy to make. My friend Casey showed me how to make this. Thank you, Casey. And it's super easy and so yummy and amazing. So what I did first is roasted my almonds, okay? So I filled a cookie sheet, sorry. Uh, you know, just like filled up a cookie sheet with almonds, roasted them in the oven about 15 minutes at 400 degrees. And then the next step is to put them in the food processor. Um, and you want to, hold on, Tug. You're gonna roast them about 15 minutes, I say, because um, it may be a little different in your oven, but you're gonna smell like the roasted nut smell when um, they're done. It's gonna get really loud here for a second, so I'm probably gonna walk away from my food processor, but all I did is put them in there with the little blade attachment, turn it on. So loud. It's not so bad after a second. The food processor is doing all the work, and Basically, it's just gonna churn away until, it's gonna break down all those almonds. Um, it takes a few minutes to do this, and you might have to take a scraper once in a while and scrape down the sides, but um, pretty soon, it's gonna just make it into almond butter, and um, I love, love, love it so much. It's, it's healthy to eat almond butter. You don't have to think that you're not supposed to eat it. Obviously, don't eat cupfuls of it, but almond butter is really healthy. There's nothing else added to this, so you don't have to worry about any extra preservatives. Sometimes I will add, um, you know, like a splash of vanilla, or I might even uh, throw in a dash of salt, but you don't have to. Um, you can also put any other extracts in it. Once in a while, I'll put maple extract, um, which I just love anything maple, so to me, that's really yummy to do that. But I'm gonna scrape down the sides real quick because you can kind of see and hear that it's slowed down to a weird noise. Hold on a second, I'm gonna put this back. Sorry, this video is gonna be long. Whoop. So now it's just kind of like crumbly, but it's a little bit sticky too. Put it back on. I'll post a picture of the finished product after it's all done. 